Hello, hello. How is everyone today? Hey. Hello, hello. How is everyone? I'm just going to put my link in. Now, if you watch me on here on Facebook, hey, Marcy. If you watch me on YouTube, my info is always down below. And uh, please always, you know, hit thumbs up, share, hey, share, send, email, text, however, share my my videos with anyone who you know knows, uh, who loves beauty or is interested in beauty or interested in a beauty career or even just like someone who just wants to smile and just laugh about you know trying me trying to put all makeup on here every day. And, uh, yeah, so there is so much news going on with Avon right now. You know, they they print out the catalogs, but they've been getting more and more things outside of the catalogs coming up on the website. So much exciting stuff. I can't even believe all that's happening. Uh, the gloves, we already have sold out of. They're all now on back order. So if you want to get on the list to be for more gloves, uh, I've just sold my last two. I, I ordered a ton to have here on, on hand. Uh, for for local people who I knew were going to, you know, I just knew somehow p p as soon as I started posing, my people were going to start wanting to order, and um, so I just hope my last two, but and, and uh, hey, thanks for watching, and then um, and then and then they are going to get more face masks. Okay, so for one thing, we have they ha you can get a box of fifty of the disposable kind. Okay, like this. So you can get a box of 50, I think it's 54 or something and some change, but that's a whole box of 50, right? Okay. Then they have a hospital kind, the kind that like where, where it's kind of cut on the angle and that's, uh, I don't know if they're the N95 that the hospital people need, but, but they're more, um, these are disposable and those are, hey, Sal, how are you? Those, those masks are more of like a solid mask, Okay. And so those are also available. But coming soon, we will have 12 different colors and designs, okay? 12. And so they are coming soon. But guess what else we're going to have? And I know this sounds crazy. We are going to have... I know, we've added cleaners. We now have cleaners. We have degreasers. We have laundry detergent. Hey, how are you? We have laundry detergent now. We have... They're now adding foods, Okay. We have packs of ramen noodles, okay? If you can imagine that, spicy ramen noodles. They're they're not even in. They're they're, they're adding so many things. They're even beyond what's in the catalog. I'm still gonna do a video where I talk about Campaign 12 because there's a lot of cool stuff in Campaign 12, but it is just amazing all that's that were that's now gonna be available for my website. I knew that when this other new company took over in January that they were going to make some changes, but I had no idea of the changes. We got the hand sanitizer in. So uh, you can order them from my website. The, the vanilla and cucumber that's on my cover photo right there, they're small, you know, like a hand sanitizer size. So you can put them in your purse, in your car, wherever. Limit three per purchase. All right, let's put on some lips here. Okay, so this is the two-in-one lip tattoo. So, yeah, so we have hand sanitizers in. Um, they're going to go quick. You know, they're going to definitely go quickly. So this is, this was the gnarly nude. This is what gnarly nude. And I wouldn't call it, it's not a pale, pale nude. It's kind of orangey. But this is, I need, I, this is on its last leg. I can tell you. <laughs> it's like a marker. Uh, it's like a marker, a thicker, I'm using the thicker end, but there's also a thin end. So, it's pretty cool. There we go. And technically, you're not supposed to lay it vertically, because if you lay, put it vertically, then all the ink goes, or, well, lip stain, goes down to one end and not the other. So, I think that was it. There I am. But, I wore some natural makeup on Sunday, on Mother's Day. <laughs> I know some of you all love who love the natural look, but I, I looked I looked back at that picture. I'm like, I need some makeup on. <laughs> Let's put. Some, I'm gonna put a brighter. I'm gonna put adoring love on here. I was like, <sighs> soft hair, soft makeup. It was like, <laughs> I 
I just didn't look like myself to me, you know? <laughs> but whatever. <laughs> hey, <laughs> thanks for the likes. All right, now, what's this one? Frostiest Mauve. Okay, so we did Adoring Love, which is a matte, and then this is the nourish Nourishing is Frostiest Mauve. There's that little pink on here. Now, usually this is a pale, a paler lip color, but because I put on top of Adoring Love, that's why it looks the way it is. Now, I have been taking classes. You've been wondering where I haven't been on every single day. It's because I've been taking classes. I have been getting a beauty certificate, a special beauty certificate, a beauty industry certificate, uh, like credited in the whole bit through Fashion Institute of Technology when taking online courses. And what was one of the projects we had to do is I had to buy five different lipsticks. And of course, to, for me to get five lipsticks, I had to either go to, I went to like a CVS because I had coupons. I had to get five different lipsticks and I, I picked like a pink nude color range and I had to do a study about them. And it's very cool. Um, and I had to, and I'll post that info in the VIP because I think those of you all who are more into beauty, really into beauty, who are in my beauty, uh, VIP group will be interested in like the swatching that I did and how long it lasted and what, what the brand said it was supposed to be, they were supposed to do versus how they performed and all that good stuff. So yeah, so I've got all that. So I've got those, and I've got five lipsticks. And and what I may do is add Avon's Avon's matte lipstick as as the sixth color. Hey, Claudia. Um, but the thing is that this was a study all about pinky nude, and our matte uh, is not pinky nude. It's more of a beige nude. So this, the fact that I did the study, I bought five different brands that weren't Avon and did a study about them and wrote about them, and that was pretty cool. That was a school project. I also had to design my own fragrance. There's like a whole bunch of things you learn about about the beauty industry when you take that course so that's what one of the things I've been 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 real super busy doing um, and and having some fun with it having some fun with it okay so let's do I have not played with this in a while the time to shine hey Grace how are you the time to shine palette um, this is still this was left over from Christmas okay this is one of those great Christmas buys that had like palettes and stuff we still have that big big palette uh, this whole set is $25, and it's, I know, they look like books. It's so cute. They remind me of the old school, um, uh, what is it, Lifesavers, things we used to get at Christmas. But so one side has this, one book has this, the other book has these, and then the other side has, this is so pretty, so, so pretty. So they're all these different colors, so we're going to play with those today. <laughs> And it's just such an awesome gift set. I mean, it was a holiday thing, but, you know, some of us love it. We, we like sparkle anytime, you know? <laughs> My sparkle girls. <laughs> All right. The sparkle queens. I would, if I would redo everything, I would do some kind of more makeup-oriented names so that people would know. Okay, so let's do, I'm going to do a little bit of this brown color here. With an angle brush. Hey, Marge, how are you? So, yeah, we've got so much. I mean, Avon has changed the fact that we've got face masks, we've got hand sanitizer. Uh, what else do we have? We're going to get the 12 different styles of face masks, so the cloth kind, you know. Um, it's just crazy. It's just crazy. All right, now I'm going to dip in this pink one just because oh, since I've got a pink lipstick on. But, you know, I, I read somewhere where somebody said that they had not put on any makeup in the past two months, that they were only putting makeup on when they left the house. And I'm like, I still have to see myself in the mirror. You know? <laughs> I don't want to scare myself every time I look in the mirror. No, I couldn't go two, two months with no makeup. Are you crazy? I still want to feel like myself, you know? So, you know, basically their true self was not wearing makeup. And, um, but, you know, I, I like feeling good. I like, makeup helps me feel good. Wearing perfume helps me feel good. Putting deodorant on helps me feel good. Using scented body wash helps me feel good. Um, 
hand lotion. I, there's so many people who are saying, oh, my hands are so dry. I'm like, aren't you using lotion? Aren't you using hand cream? Use a hand cream. Use a moisturize after every time. You know, are you moisturizing every time you get out of the shower? I'm amazed at how many people. I'm like, okay, this is self-care 101, people. <laughs> get a good hand cream. <laughs> Self-care 101. <laughs> and if you don't have one, <laughs> check out my site and find one. I can I can recommend you one, too. <laughs> Message me. I'm amazed. I'm amazed. And, and I'm someone who used to hate. I hated hand lotion. I hated those big, big things of Jergens. I hated the smell. I hate used to hate the way it came out. I used to hate the color. I used to hate the way it glopped up at the corner of the, the applicator. Ugh. And if I would be working somewhere that somebody had it, I would get nauseous, okay? So for years, I didn't until they started coming out with lotions that had scents that I like, I didn't like to I didn't like to use them either, you know? But, you know, fi either find one that you a scent that you like or use unscented. You know, if you're someone who doesn't like scents, you know, use unscented. We've got it. We've got it all, right? <laughs> hey, Avon, we have it all. All right, this is some of our new magic dust. <laughs> Come aboard the magic dust, <laughs> magic bus, magic dust. <laughs> We've got that. So, um, so yeah. And the good thing is, is you can turn this little thing here so that it doesn't keep coming out. <sighs> smart, 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 very smart, smart marketing, smart product design. So that's another thing I've been studying in that course is a uh, product design. And, uh, you know, like why this logo looks good, why this font looks good on this product and, and, uh, Hey, why this product, you know, why that looks good on this product versus a different type of lettering, you know, all those kinds of things. That's the things I've been studying. So yeah, it's great. It's great. Who knows what we'll do with it once the, <laughs> once with all this Corona business is, uh, going on. Okay, so I'm going to use this color as a highlight. Highlight, highlight. And I love my fan brushes and I love how big these pans are. These pans are so fun. Okay. See? See? A lot of us would just use this blush and think that was enough. But this is the key. Look at how much more vibrant this side looks. Okay? And you can't tell as bad. So you can see I've got some bags under my eyes and some wrinkles. But suddenly you put this on here. Suddenly I'm 16 again. This side still says I'm 55. <laughs> I just turned 55. This side says you're 16 again. Okay. So who wants to feel 16 again? I know I do. You know. You got to keep, keep it like you're a... Uh... Isn't that amazing? It makes such a difference. A little, a lot of us don't understand, but you wonder why. You look at J Lo, and people are like, "Wow, she looks so young." It's a, it's the placement of certain products. Granted, she's had work. Granted, she has helped. Granted, she has people helping her work out. But as far as her face goes, as well as the face makeup on her body, I mean, they put body makeup on her, self tanner, but then they also do a whole lot of shimmering on her legs and shimmer. It's a whole, you know. A high maintenance, you know, celebrity, but you can have a little bit of that high maintenance celebrity look right here, you know, <laughs> if you want, you know, hey, Jennifer, how are you? So, yeah, it's just amazing. A little bit in the right places. Now, see, see how I have a little bit under here? Dip a little in this brown. The shadow, it's all smoke and mirrors. <laughs> it's like a pair of high heels or a good good bra, you know. It's all everything helps, right? <laughs> everything helps. Every little bit helps. <laughs> and we've got we've got we've we actually have some dress shoes now in. We've got some cute dresses. We've got so in addition now we've got all those defense things, a face mask and uh, gloves and and hand sanitizer and um um I was dropped this off. As usual, um, <laughs> hand sanitizer, but we still have the clothes, we still have the fashion, we still have the jewelry, still have the makeup. 
we got it together and then now we're starting to sell foods okay so i have my husband is a ramen noodle person i had i had no idea the popularity of ramen noodles i just thought it was one of those things that college kids ate once in a blue moon or if they were like on a budget or something I had no idea. I mean, I had seen people going to restaurants and doing the whole thing with the egg and the, all the, just throw everything with the kitchen sink in with some noodles, you know, and apparently it's popular. It's not my thing, but hey, you know. But now when I go to the store to buy him, because he likes to alternate. Sometimes he likes to do a can of chunky soup for lunch or or like a Chef Boyardee thing for lunch or something, or he alternates with Raymond's. So it does help like a 16. <laughs> Okay, well, I love my age too, but I like, I like feeling, I like feeling, uh, I like feeling like 16 with, with this kind of a look, you know? So, uh, but anyway, so he likes to alternate sometimes with the Raymond noodles. Every time I go to the store, Raymond noodles is gone. It's gone because I get so many people with kids at home feeding kids and that whole thing. So, uh, amazingly enough, I guess, you know, it's just crazy that a Avon is has gone into partnership with a co company that's uh, doing noodles, you know. So you can buy a pack of Raymond. I think it's like a pack of five for five ninety nine. That's on my website. Uh, and it's just it's just like amazing. So this is one of our ultra luxury liner pencils within the brow. And this is what dark brown, yeah, dark brown. <laughs> Not a very exciting title, but it, it is what it is. <laughs> it is what it is. It is what it is. I'll just fill this in a little bit more here. Now you can see how much better they are. My my lashes, especially on this side, are so much better too since I've been using the serum. Oh my gosh. That serum is amazing. Okay, a little spoolie action here. Little spoolie. Look down. Look at this. Tired looking brow. Energized looking brow. Tired brow. I mean, I would I wouldn't go back to that age. 16 is and for real, for real. Only knowing what I know now. And only in that time frame. I wouldn't want to be sick. I feel, I, I actually keep saying this. I feel bad for kids now. The weather, especially around where we live. One nice day to ten rainy days. And it's been that way since last September. It's actually been that way since 2012. Um, we used to have some rain and, you know, bad storms when I was growing up. But there were more nice days. More beautiful days. The weather here in the D.C. area, I mean, it's, it is sort of originally a swamp, but this is like, it, it's really bad. And so, like, for games, you know, games get kids' games get rained out a lot, or they just do it anyway, and they're all muddy, and I feel sorry for all the moms, anybody, the parents trying to clean all that stuff, getting in the car. Oh, my God. Um... I feel sorry about this, you know, school shootings the last 20 years. I feel sorry for the for, for this virus, you know, uh, not having proms and all that. But no, if I could go back to like 1983 to 82 and go back with my mindset now, I would rule that school. I wouldn't be, I wouldn't be on the, uh, I'd be standing up for all the kids that are bullied. I would be, I would be like, you know, I'd be very vocal. Back then, I was very shy. I had no, I didn't have a good confidence. I didn't have a, a level of, of, you know, I just put up with a lot of garbage in my life, like many of us do when we're young. Um, made a lot of dumbass mistakes with relationships and stupid, stupid things. But yeah, I'd go back only, only knowing what I know now. Um, took me a lot longer to learn certain lessons. I'd make, you know, better decisions with my career um, when I was when I wasn't tied down I probably would have traveled more I wouldn't travel now I mean I wouldn't I, I, I haven't traveled much in the last few years because of because of the cleanliness situation and illnesses and all that stuff I started to notice I started to notice things were different about a few years ago and uh, and actually it was 2007 that I got sick from um, a blanket at a resort in the Bahamas and uh, 
That's a whole story. That's a whole story for another. Hey, Nina. That's a whole story. That's a story for another time. <laughs> But, um, but yeah, uh, I could tell that the cleanliness standards were not, not up to what they used to be. Prices got cheaper for traveling and all that stuff, but that's because they weren't paying the clean, staff to clean. And that's how you have these people getting sick all the time. So, the fact that a company, a glamour company, that like Avon, is now selling things like masks and gloves... And, oh, seeing that you're home all the time and Raymond's are popular, hey, we'll jump on the Raymond bandwagon. <laughs> I mean, the fact that we're selling Raymond noodles <laughs> from our website. They're like, hey, you know, people aren't buying, if people don't care about glitter makeup, hey, we'll, we'll sell them what they need, you know? <laughs> Hand sanitizer is what you need, right? So, you know, we still have all the fun stuff. We still have the fun stuff. We've got some silver high heels. We've got some cool dresses. We've got some fun things. But we've got the things that you, you know, things that'll pr protect you and keep, you know, keep the things safe, you know. So, that's good. That's great. That's great. So, check out, check out things on my website. Alright, that was a little eye primer I put on. And, okay, so let's play around a little bit more with this time to shine. It is time to shine, whether you're home or not. <laughs> time to shine. It's called the time to shine palette. So let's play with some of these, okay? Let's play! Alright, let's do a little bit of this gold shimmer. A little shimmer. <laughs> I told you how it's now people are calling those glimmer sticks the glimmers. Just because we always talk about the glimmers. We always joke and say glimmers. Say, hey Amy. They say, I say, so what did you get? Oh, a few glimmers. <laughs> A glimmer, I know. They're now calling them that all the time from us. <laughs> That's the trend now. A little glimmer, a little shimmer. It's actually the glimmer sticks. Have, let's, let's use a glimmer too. <laughs> Some glimmer. <laughs> oh, I love it. Love it. Okay. Let's do, ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, so should I do, let's do some bronze. Let's do a little bronze. We'll go from the pale gold to this. I have not played with this bronzy color very much. Let's, let me get a, get a clean. Okay, let's play with this. I saw really, I saw Celebrity last night with some really great bronze shadow on. I don't even know her name. And can you believe it? There's a celebrity who I don't know, I don't even know their name. They were on last night on Watch What Happens Live. Denise Richards was on, of course, talking about the, uh, Beverly Hills Housewives. Then there was this other woman who's an actress, and I guess she's kind of like a writer. You know, sometimes I'll have those interesting people. They're kind of like, kind of like, uh, they are they act, but they're also writers. So they're a little on the, like, kind of, like, more like a fan type of person where they're in some things once in a while, but they're more like fans of the shows. So, yeah, it's a real pretty bronze. And that's in, in the time to shine. So, yeah, she had some go had really pretty... She had blue eyes, like like my color, and she had this really pretty bronze um, shadow on. So, in honor of her... Like, I'll look up her name because I have no idea. She's she's one of those actors. She's not like a main, main A-list person, but like I said, she's kind of... Um, but really funny and good, good commentary. Like a fan of Bravo type stuff. All right, let's do... I love this teal. I'm gonna play around with this teal and this and this blue a little bit. Let's play. A little in the corner here. A little in the corner. <laughs> Meet you on the corner. <laughs> a little bit of a wing. On the wing and a prayer. Watch where you're working with singer since one o'clock, not what you do. Ah, okay. Let's do a little liner here. Now that lady did not have this on, but this kind of makes it me. <laughs> okay. But it was really pretty. And I was like, well, I've got that bronze. I could be, I need to wear that more often. <laughs> But see, that's where you, a little thing like that can inspire you if you're paying attention. A lot of people might just say, oh, she looks good. But I can look at that and go, 
It's a bronze shadow, golden bronze shadow, with a with a with a top top note of a pale yellow highlight. <laughs> top color. And uh, so yeah, but busy with this uh, beauty. Uh, my beauty. These beauty courses is really fun. Really fun. I wish I could design, I, I designed a fragrance, my own fragrance, and how I wanted to smell, how I wanted the bottle to look like, what I wanted the you know, for advertising to be, and all that stuff. It's very cool. I just wish I could have had the money to put it together. <laughs> all right, now let's get, fan this, blend this out a little bit. Where was I? Oh, you like the teal? Yeah. Or the bronze. It's the bronze. Bronzy color. Here we go. All right. Are we ready for a glimmer? <laughs> oh, every time I every time I grab one, I think of glimmer and shimmer and all that. Now, one thing I have not been doing much of that during this quarantine time is jewelry. Because I've only done, only had a couple occasions to do jewelry because it's so easy to like you get comfortable doing something and you fall you lean on something you have earrings or or ne a necessity of wearing a necklace all right now this is this is, this is a black glimmer black glimmer stick little black glimmer little black glimmer stick bronze shimmer <laughs> <laughs> yes bronze shimmer Oh my god, we're gonna have a whole language, right? Are we gonna have a whole language here? Oh my god. Oh, my friend Sharon needs to come on here because she was the one who started calling. I said, what did you buy? Oh, a few glimmers. <laughs> She's gonna get such a kick out of this. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna be laughing so hard. I can't even put the rest of the on. I'm laughing. Oh my god. Bronze Shimmer. Hey, Sally. How are you? I was just thinking I'm gonna call you when I get off when I get off of this this live. And instead of instead of brown sugar, like how ever since I already did well well it's like it's, <laughs> well wild berry keeps on drawing, we'll do bronze shimmer <laughs> instead of, Oh my god, we'll do bronze shimmer instead of brown sugar. <laughs> Let's get this little closer lash line here. Uh Oh, bronze, bronze shimmer. <laughs> oh my god, it's so funny. Lip glitter and bronze shimmer. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you know, you have to laugh during these times, you know, any way we can get some good laughs in. Oh my god. I was talking about this friend of mine. It was actually it's, it's you know out of out of the darkness. A friend of mine's another well not a person I know no but a person I follow who you know you develop being close to. I'm just taking this brush and kind of painting. He lost his mother recently, and he, but he was talking about this friend of his who often comes on his show, who goes to funerals all the time. It's kind of like a funeral crasher, like a wedding crasher. And I remembered from that conversation, I remembered how a friend of mine, when he moved, and I, he, he might be on here at some point, he'll remember when he first moved to a certain city, he moved away from home, and he loves weddings so much that he would cry if he saw, and they, and they were talking about this today on this other guy's show, saying about how his friend was a funeral crasher, he said he liked to go and see like who was there, and all what people were wearing, and all the whole thing, and... Oh, this with this friend of mine, he did that with weddings. Like, if he was walking by a church and he saw that there was, like, a wedding, like, a limo in front of a church, he'd walk on in, you know. <laughs> he wouldn't crush the the the, um, the reception, but he'd go sit in the back, be sitting in the back just so he could watch his beautiful ceremony, <laughs> see what the bride had on, see if the grooms have been were cute. <laughs> A whole bit. And I said to Patrick, I said, you don't care about weddings. If you were walking by and saw a wedding, it wouldn't, you wouldn't occur to you to wonder what the bride had on, what her dress looked like, or were the, were the, were the, were the <laughs> bridesmaids cute, or were those girls are cute, or is cute. He's like, oh, I could care. I said, you can care less. But I said, only people I know would. 
Happy birthday. And they weren't crashing to get free food or anything. He was crashing just to see the ceremony. It was this beautiful, these big churches. and <laughs> See the dresses. He called me, oh, I just saw the most beautiful wedding the other day. So who got married? I don't know. <laughs> it's crazy. He'd sit in the back row and just like, oh, you know, just take it all in, you know. Just take it in. <laughs> Just enjoy the the wedding ceremony. So funny. Oh my god. And I hadn't thought about that in a long time. Uh. <laughs> and then he would just leave. He'd just leave and go up about, about the rest of his day. He wasn't even going. He wouldn't go to the reception or anything. You know, nothing like that. He was just going to enjoy the enjoy the ceremony. The you know the singing and all. <laughs> oh, that's a, oh god. In certain churches, he would walk by. He'd make sure he walked by on a Saturday. So he, <laughs> they were having a good wedding. Oh, here you go. <laughs> oh, so funny. It's just like wacky. You know, only, like I said, people I know. <laughs> but, yeah, so this guy, this other guy who I, who I follow was saying how, you know, this friend of his, of course, he was like, oh, of course, my friend who loves funerals, he, he's going to make an appearance at this at his mother's his mother's funeral. He was like, yeah, you know he's going to show up because he, he's a funeral hopper. Oh, my God. Oh, whatever. Sometimes it's a way to get together, you know. I feel the emotion. But this is just crazy. It's crazy, 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 crazy. It's a crazy time. Uh, wedding crashers. <laughs> a little love at first lash. I actually ordered one of the other mascaras that I had not used before. Um, I'm kind of excited to try it. I can't remember one of the one of the ones. I'm just gonna look it up because I can all the name escapes me. It was it's still available and it's been available. It's one of the oh big and multiplied volume, the gray one. One I have not tried. I've tried all the other ones. And I thought, well, I may as well try it since oh my god, it's the first time she worked. There's been a lot happening around here today. I look you can see, look at how look at my lashes. Look at how amazing this love first lash. Um this is the first time she's barked around here in a while. But today there's been a lot of activity. It was trash day. People put their, uh, you know, everybody's home <laughs> around here. And uh, they have to, they put it down to the corner before the trash time. And then they have to push it back in this row of, of townhouses. So, um, and then if any time an Amazon delivery person or FedEx or whatever has come to somebody's house in this. Uh, I was like, how many coats am I going to put on? <laughs> as many as I need. <laughs> as many as I need. Okay, so. But yeah, wedding crush. <laughs> and he would tell me, oh, the, you should have seen this gown. It was so gorgeous. Uh, uh, grooms were cute. <laughs> yeah. Uh, we will get back to that time. I know we will at some point. But if you think about it, this is why. If we, a hundred years ago, it was a hundred, well, 102 years ago, 1918, when they had that other disease that kept people at home for 16 months. And so then that's why by 1920, it was like the roaring 20s, because people were like, oh, we can finally get out of the house and... It was finally safe to go out and have a good time. It's just crazy. It's a hundred years later, repeating itself. But you know, our lives were people's lives weren't as uh, as involved. You could have, a lot of people had gardens. You know, they were more self sufficient. So, um, and chickens and things. I mean, even in the thirties, when my mom was born in thirty two, so when she was like ten years old, so it would have been forty two. She lived in town, but they still had, like, enough of a backyard where they had chickens and stuff. So she grew up with, you know, garden, you had gardens and you had chickens. And uh, so people were much more self-sufficient so that if 
uh, you know, it wasn't, we weren't as dependent on grocery stores. So it's pretty amazing, you know, if you think about it. <clears throat> you know, I may go back to doing my couponing, um, my couponing videos and how to stretch out groceries, stories, uh, videos, or, and, uh, may do some of some of more of those that people would be into it because um you know my income's changed significantly i mean i'm so grateful for avon so grateful for avon if someone's been furloughed if someone's lost their job if someone's been furloughed or fired or whatever laid off all those things the, the, or if your income has been cut the avon there's two to to the end of the month till the 26th uh, to to sign up because it's a free sign up and people are earning you know people are earning especially if we're selling face masks and gloves and things like that it's more than just makeup um, and being able to help others and um, you know it's wonderful because I can see how I've been helping people the people who might not have been sent, you know, tried other direct sales things and didn't make it and being, you know, giving them good, solid advice as their upline leader and telling them how they can succeed and, and then seeing them succeed and have extra money coming in to help them during this crisis. That's what I've been doing. You know, there's those kinds of things that's really, really important and it's been good to be part of the solution. We can all come on here and, and, and vent and, 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 and complain, but the fact that I can be home and, and people, anyone can be home and earning from this, it has been, it's been a lifesaver. It's been a lifesaver for a lot of people. Um, so, uh, so yeah, so that's been, that's been, you know, from mascara to face masks to, you know, the eyeshadow. Of course, I come on here and do a makeup, but there's a whole bunch of stuff on here that we, uh, that we have. All right, little setting spray. And I'm going to deliver some gloves today, actually, to help out some people. <clears throat> and, uh, some people who ordered gloves. And, uh. I just saw that, what was, the gloves are actually now in back order, but, um, but we'll be get, getting more in soon, so, yeah, today is kind of like a, just kind of like a half up, half, half down day, kind of a day. Let's put a little hoops on. That's the one thing about, also, face masks is with earrings, you know, it's like, you don't know with, um. Sometimes I'll just do a double scarf, and then that comes around here. <clears throat> so, but it's just sometimes nice to just put a little on, just to feel together. It's so pretty, 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 pretty. Just put a little lump right here. I can see it. Now, it's um, anyone in the USA, USA, Canada, or Puerto Rico can sign up under me, okay? I've got people uh, uh, in Utah, um, people around my area, West, um, Maryland, D.C., um, people in West Virginia, um, anywhere around the USA can sign up under me, uh, as well as Canada and uh, Puerto Rico, you know, so... It's awesome, and if you speak Spanish, we have a whole lot, or if you prefer to speak Spanish, or have a lot of Spanish-speaking uh, and Spanish-reading friends, we have a ton of literature. Uh, you can get all the brochures in Spanish. We even have our videos every every day on our rep sites, okay? Our rep pages in here on Facebook. They have English speaking, you know, tutorials and English speaking things on how to build your business. Then they always do another one in Spanish. So all the books, brochures, and all the flyers you can get in Spanish too. Um, you know, it's really fantastic if you prefer to build your business uh, in in that in your language that you feel more comfortable in. You can order everything from in Spanish. Watch the Spanish tutorials. Watch the Spanish education. It's amazing how you know Avon is really flexible that way, and so. You know, um, it's awesome. And uh, to tell you the truth, in my area, there is a woman uh, who's also she's not, she's Puerto Rican herself, and she's I think she had originally signed up in Puerto Rican, um, 
maybe signed up in Puerto Rico and then moved here. I'm not really sure. Or, or she goes back and forth, but she won an award. She is selling $10,000 a campaign. Okay. $10,000 a campaign. And she's at a very, very high level in terms of commission. Can you imagine making half of that commission? So, okay. So she's selling on average 10,000 campaign. That means she's selling 20,000 a campaign a month. So then take home she's probably taking home ten thousand dollars a month with selling avon and that's and that's just in her sales that's not in what she has in recruits and what's going on so people can you can build up i mean there's a lot of people in the average kind of moderate level in the hobbyist level and there's a lot of people who are like me building maybe three or four people underneath them and then they have a couple people underneath them and you know slowly building and it takes time but there's a huge population of people who in this company who are actually earning and doing amazing things so you know but you have to work it and you have to put the time into it but it is amazing what you can do okay I can't imagine I mean it's like wow you know to know that you can just you know be completely flexible and 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 be a part of this company is just incredible so uh, so anyway I just want to give you that not everybody can be at that level I have ne I, I can't even imagine how much she's been hustling and what she does but the fact and how she's built up and, and how all that. But when you get to that level, uh, that's pretty amazing, you know. So anyway, thanks so much for watching. Please share my videos. Please hit thumbs up. Uh, you know, I appreciate the support always. Let me know if you're interested in any, uh, you know, being a part of this. Or if you want to order, you know, you can order. Go to my website directly. Check out. If you want to order Raymond's and your store's out of Raymond Noodles, consider getting it from me. I never thought I'd be, I never thought that we would get to that point where we're, we're selling all these things that people are out of. But, you know, it's just one of those things. Jump on the bandwagon. You know, we've got face masks. Um, you know, uh, gloves, hand wa hand sanitizer, hand wash, all kinds of great stuff that people need right now. And uh, and uh, so, I hope you all have a wonderful day. Stay safe, stay healthy. You know, I hope everything is going great with your families. All that good stuff. And I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye.